to CBS Sports coverage of NCAA basketball. Today's game is between the Arizona Wildcats and the Wright State Raiders. And as we get set to tip off, let's take a look at two of the players we'll be following tonight. And of course, our starting lineup. No matter the game, the starting five must be ready to play. As soon as the ball is tossed up, we've got to be ready. Too many teams fall behind early because they are just not ready to play. All right, of course, those records were from the 2008-2009 season, but the rosters are updated for the current year. Number one, Arizona, versus number 16, Wright State. Wright State just won this first four game. I'm recording this right after they won it on Thursday night. Moving the ball around. Arizona has an All-American on their team, Benedict Mathurin. Arizona's coach Tommy Lloyd looking over, seeing what they're doing on offense, and they get the miss, but they get the rebound. They put it back up and in. Arizona up to zip early on. Tanner Holden just scored 35 points, or at least 35 points. That was when I stopped watching it in the lat in the first four game. Of course, we got. Gus Johnson and Bill Raptor on commentary as always, and we get a charge called on Wright State. 420 to go in the first half, plays it, but yeah, Wright State was super impressive in the first four games. They scored 93 points. Foul on the floor, oh, and it rims out. Foul on A.J. Brown. Benedict Mathurin at the line, apparently a political science major. Knocks down the first one. Knocks down the second one as well. Four to zero here early on. Oh, and Arizona tries to come up with the steal. They are able to do so. Great backdoor or backcourt pressure by Arizona, and they get the points off the turnover. Already up six nothing in this first minute. Looking to move the ball around. Got a man driving down low. They get it to him. Trying to save it again. Oh, he stepped out of bounds there, but it will remain right state ball for the Raiders. Looking to get the ball in. Oh, no. And another turnover committed by the Raiders. Three turnovers already. Arizona looking to get even more points off turnovers. Looking down low. They missed the shot, though. Wright State is still yet to attempt the shot. They finally do, and they miss it. Their coach is furious. They want everyone to try to get a touch, reverse the ball around a little bit. And a turnover committed by Arizona there. In transition, right side pulls it back. The alley -oop. Putting it up and in. Arizona not really taking advantage too much of these of these right state turnovers. Looking to drive them to third in contact. No foul called. And Wright State comes up with the rebound. We have seen one number one seed fall in these simulations. We saw Texas Southern upset Kansas. Wright State moving the ball around over in the corner. And they come up with another turnover. Arizona currently up six to two. Over in the corner. Looking down low, hook shot, misses. Arizona not really doing too well from the field here in the last couple minutes. Looking down low, rising, firing, but not connecting. Both teams going cold here. Arizona has not scored in the last two minutes. Looking down low, extra pass. Able to get it to fall off the glass. There you go, Arizona. That's how you break a scoreless streak. Out 
For three, a deep three right state splash! There you go, right state. We need to see some three point shooting in this matchup. I think that's the first three attempted. Oh, I mean, that works too, just driving down the lane uncontested. 10 to 5 now, just over one minute to go in this game. Four turnovers committed by Wright State. One minute left on the game clock. Ten seconds on the shot clock. Gets rejected Arizona with the block. Looking to run out in transition, but they're in with it. Five turnovers committed by Wright State. Arizona scores yet again. The turnovers have been what's killing Wright State so far. 12 to 5. Out on the left wing. Looking down low. A little hop step. Puts it up and in. 12 to 7. Wright State staying within striking distance, though. Arizona's not 100% putting him away. 20 seconds to go in this first half. Receives the pass. A little pick and roll action. Passes it out. Deep three. Splash! There you go, Benedict Mathurin. 15 to 7. Wright State going to pull up here for three. And it falls short. Arizona going into the half with a 15 to 7 lead. Both teams shooting 50 plus percent. It's just those turnovers that have been killing Wright State in this game. Doing a good job keeping Holden in check after his big his big game in the first four. Wright State talking things over before the break. In that first half, Mathurin is the leading scorer with seven. Then you got Brown and Mathurin also leading the way in rebounds. And Mathurin leading the way in assists. Look at that. Doing it all for Arizona. And another turnover committed by Wright State. They are just giving the ball away to Arizona. For three. Splash! 10 to 2 run for Arizona right now. It was 8 to 5. But now it is 18 to 7. Holding with it. Looking down low, able to get it to go. It was a dangerous pass, but it worked out for him. Cutting the deficit to nine. The third and with it, just driving down. A little hop step, gets rejected though. Gets rejected again, two big blocks by Wright State. Looking to push the ball before in transition, it's holding. So that's pull it back. Moving the ball around, looking down low, and he gets it to go. 18 to 11. Looking to use the pick and roll. Nice dump off. Woo, he gets the bounce to fall. Nice touch on that, 20 to 11. Wright State's had a ton of turnovers, but as you see, Arizona's only scored five points off of them. Not even a point per turnover, basically. Oh, dangerous pass. Arizona comes up with yet another turnover. Wright State's had like seven or eight of them this game. When they don't turn the ball over, Wright State's doing pretty good, but, I mean, they turn it over on half their possessions, it feels like. I think that's a deep three, and they get it to go. That is a splash. 23 to 11, Arizona over Wright State. On the outside. Moving the ball around, looking down low. Using the pick and roll. Looking down low. And they get it to fall, bringing it to within 10. Or I guess 10 exactly. <laughs> 
2.30 to go in this game. Mathern with it. Using the pick and roll. Oh, yep, there we go. Oh, getting doubled. Able to escape out of it for three. Splash! <laughs> this has just been a murder so far. The complete opposite of the Texas Southern Kansas game. Arizona 26 to 13, looking down low, rising, firing, knocking it down. 26 to 15. Contact foul called, or not foul, no foul called. Refs swallow their whistle on that one. 11 point game, 26 to 15. Maybe Wright State can cut the deficit to single digits here. They rise, fire. They knock it down, nine point game, 26 to 17. Wright State not a 100% going away yet. And a charge committed by Arizona. Coloco with six points on three or four shooting. Wright State trying to stick in it. They can cut the deficit to six or seven here. Bring in the double Arizona. Wright State can't be just dribbling it out here. They got to start getting shots off. Seven turnovers committed by Wright State in this game. You can't be wasting this clock, Wright State. You're down by nine. Ten on the shot clock. A long position here for the Raiders. Not sure what they're doing. They settle for a deep three. And they don't get it to connect, and they are going to have to intentionally foul because of it. Arizona fans chanting to warm up the bus. Warm up the bus. Warm up the bus. Foul on Trey Calvin there. Fans still chanting to warm up the bus. Here we go at the line. Benedict Mathurin. 10 points on three of seven shooting. 42.8 to go. Knocks down the first one, making it a four possession game. 27 to 17. And the substitutes have been placed into the game. You heard that substitution sound. Knocks down to that next one. 28 to 17 Arizona over Wright State. Wright State looking to get some basket here. They got a man wide open over there. They settle for a deep three. I mean, it's a splash, but that's just going to extend the game even more. They're going to foul again. 33 seconds to go. Now they're bringing back in the starters because they just made that splash. Point guard number 12 at the line. Knocks down the first one. 29 to 20. This one to get it back out to a four possession lead. With 33 seconds to go. Knocks it down. Let's see what Wright State does. Another three. That one does not fa fall, though. Still fouling. Not sure why Wright State is deciding to do that. At the line, though, it's a center. Maybe that's why. Knocks down the first one. 31 to 20. This one's over. There's literally 24 seconds left. 11-point game, maybe 12. A 12-point game for Wright State. Arizona knows this one is pretty much over. Moving the ball around. Number 40 loves to shoot these threes. And Wright State has called off the dogs. Arizona going to walk 
Got him here with the W. Way out on the right wing. And that will be it. Arizona wins the first round matchup against 16 C Wright State. Benedict Mathurin, winning player of the game with 12 points and three assists. That concludes our coverage on CBS Sports. For the governor, Bill Raftery, I'm Gus Johnson saying good night. So there we have it. Arizona moves on before we log off. Let's take a look at the statistics for the Wildcats. Coloco with six, Tubalist with nothing, Terry with seven, then you got Chris Lowe with three, and then Benedict Mathurin with 12. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you all later.